Welcome back. A new novel is bringing together for the very first time the work of two of the greatest writers of modern fiction. The book, which has the title Eruption, follows a team of scientists trying to prevent the fatal consequences of a historic volcanic eruption. The novel was started by best-selling author Michael Crichton back in 1994, but was still unfinished when he passed away in the year 2008. But over the past several years, Crichton's legendary counterpart, James Patterson, completed the thriller after he was enlisted by Crichton's widow, Sherry, who says she knew she had to, quote, go big to find the right author to finish her late husband's work. And James and Jerry join us now. Jerry is also the CEO of Crichton, which prefers the work of Michael Crichton. Uh, thank you both for being here. Um, Sherry, let's start with you. Um, the, the backstory of this book, your husband was working on it before he passed away. Tell us how far he had gotten and why you decided it needed to be completed. Well, it got far enough along to where I was left with a cliffhanger that was completely unexpected, obviously. And so I went searching back for every all the files and everything. I couldn't find what I needed. And it had such richness to the story. It was true Crichton through and through and his love of Hawaii and, you know, all the twists and turns that Michael was famous for, all of his scientific detail. And I was like, we, I, I can't just stop right here. I, I have to have, I have to have the next, what's next? So what why was next was me. Yeah, well, I mean, it went right here. So this tell is, us why. Is, Since Michael saying. was six nine, I'm actually she went <laughs> shorter. But you know. So why was James the guy? Well, because number one, it, I I I always loved James's work. Jim now, as I call him. Um, I love Jim's work. And I was like, you know, it, it, he has what it needs, which is that, you know, page turning, that great pace, that that attention to characters. And I needed that. And and I was like, why 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 would I go anywhere but big? I need I need two great minds on that page collaborating together. So I And I had been this huge Michael Crichton fan forever. I'd read I think I've read all of his novels. Um, and uh, it was a challenge for me because I usually don't have a lot of science in my stories. And to keep, you know, a fast paced story with science in it. And I thought that would be exciting. And also, I, I think this is the kind of novel that it used to used to be, but you don't get them anymore. Um, the, the kind of novel where um, you you want to keep reading, but you don't want it to end. Mm -hmm. uh, you so, know, and, that, and that's what I think this book is. So you mentioned the challenge of, of having to incorporate the science, which of course Michael was was so famous for in Jurassic Park yeah. uh, and the rest. Um, you, but, but also, you're, you're, you're being handed something that is partially completed. I mean, mm -hmm. you do work with collaborators at times, but this is a different, a different challenge for you. Walk us yeah. through how you made it happen. Well, I think the hard thing here, and I, I, I do challenge readers, and a lot of people are already, it's already number one on Amazon, which is yeah. spectacular. But um, I challenge readers to figure out where Michael stops and where I begin. And that, that was a challenge, and, and I really wanted to do that because, in a way, this is sort of like uh, another chapter in their love story because, it, because this book was so important to, to Sherry and Michael. So tell uh, us a little bit that more. Was, that was pressure, too. Yeah, no, <laughs> of course was. it was. Of course it was. And we'll get to your verdict in a second. But tell, <laughs> tell us about. Tell us a little more about, about, the, about the plot. I feel like the Trump now. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, a lot of verdicts are right. Uh, tell us a little bit more about what readers should expect. Uh, you know, fast-paced but smart. It, 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 the thing that Michael had done, and it was in the, the pages that he had written, is, is these two storylines. One is this volcano that threatens to destroy the island of Hawaii, which is, would be enough. But there's something on the island. There's some toxic waste there that could have a, a major effect on the world. It could just, you know, literally destroy all plant life on the world. Uh, and I, when I was reading what, what Sherry had sent over, I went, oh, my God, this is pure Crichton. And, 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 and the story was set. And, and also, to some extent, the voice was there, which, which was very helpful. And, and Sherry, last word to you. Are you happy with, with how it turned out? And how do you think, do you think, if, uh, how do you think your husband would feel? I think Michael would be so proud. He would be excited. My son is excited. He was like, oh, my gosh, Mom. And to have like. Sherry was pregnant during, you know, what, what, when Michael died. Yes, I was pregnant when, when Michael died. And, and that was one of the main reasons why I got into his work so, so deep the way I did. And mm -hmm. when I found this piece, the piece that he had always talked about, I just knew 
I knew it had to be completed. Well, we are certainly glad it is. Two of the absolute biggest names in modern fiction, Michael Crichton and James Patterson. The new novel, Eruption, is indeed on sale now and number one on Amazon, we just learned. Co-author <laughs> James Patterson and CEO of Crichton's son, Sherry Crichton, thank you both very much for being here. Thank you.